Hello friends, welcome to my channel Universal Telegram 1. Today we are going to learn about the female reproductive system. First of all, we can see the position of the reproductive organs as a worm. Then we are discuss about the internal reproductive organs and the external reproductive organs. First of all, we can see the internal reproductive organs as a worm ovary, ovarian ligament, fallopian tubes, bladder, vagina and the urethra are the internal reproductive organs. Then we are discuss about the cross section of the internal reproductive organs as a ovary, ovarian ligament, fallopian tubes, vagina, uterine smooth muscles, endometrium, cervix and the external orifice of the uterus. These are the cross section of the internal reproductive organs then we are discuss about the external reproductive organs as a mons pubis clitoris urethral opening perineum labia majora labia minora vaginal opening and the anus are the external reproductive organs of the female reproductive system then we are discuss about the menstrual cycle of the female reproductive system now let's begin the female menstrual cycle represents a series of natural changes that occur cyclically. The cycle starts on the first day of menstrual bleeding. It is 28 days long on average. Ovulation takes place in the middle. During the ovulation, the mature egg is released from the ovary. It enters the fallopian tube and travels towards the uterus. Then the embryo attached to the endometrium which is thick after ovulation in preparation for the embryo. If fertilization does not take place, the endometrium dies and it is sloughed off by menstrual bleeding. Menstruation usually lasts 4 to 6 days and 30 to 50 ml of blood is discharged on average. After the menstruation, the newly formed endometrium starts thickening right after menstruation. It is only about 0.5 mm thick. While on the 14th day of the cycle during ovulation, it grows to about 3 to 5 mm.